All right. First thing you do is let out all the tire. I mean air. I do the back of the rim first. Jack up the car until you have enough space to stick the rim under the car. Then get another jack. And you put the jack in the jack point of the car while the car is still jacked up. And on the tire. Then you get any piece of wood just to hold down the tire on the other side. And you put it there. Then you commence breaking the bead. Hold on. Make sure you have it in a good position. You'll hear a pop usually. There it is. So, usually you break it on both sides at least, or maybe you have to glue it on. Flip the broom. Ah. Uh. There it goes. So I'm a man, so instead of using soap, I mean oil, I use soap. And <coughs> and spit. Because that's how men do it. Spread around the soap and stuff like that. Now comes my favorite part. I have it on top of another tire because I don't want to scratch the front of my rim. That's why I always pop out the back side first. You get that thing in there and you go, oh my god! Oh, no. They take a stretch break. Mm. Oh yeah. They move the hips around a bit. Mm. Mm. Other direction. Mm. If you squat thrust. You might be asking yourself, why is he doing that sexy position with the, the wheel and the rim? It's because I found the perfect spot to pry it out. And then you start pulling, pull, you pull. Oh, damn it, you keep pulling. See that? That's what you want. And now when it pops in, you get really pissed. So. Oh, damn it. You wanna try to get that? Oh, yeah. Oh, and then wiggle it out of. Yep, yep, yep. Now you let a little bit in and you go, oh, shit. Pull it out a little, and a little bit, and you go, oh damn it, oh, damn, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That crap in there, and then you start prying out the other side of the tires, something like this, you just kind of stick a screwdriver in there, and just go, mm, mm. damn it, didn't work. So you try again, and you go, damn it, you go, oh, damn. You start pulling on that crap. No one's, gonna do, no one's gonna use this tutorial. You start wiggling that crap, you start going like this and stuff. Bam! Oh, damn. You're going like that. You're like, oh, damn, the tire's coming up. And then you're like, oh, ass crap. But then you keep going, oh. You go, yeah, ow. Make sure not to kill yourself while you're watching this tutorial. If you kill yourself while you're watching it, it's not my problem. Damn it. Damn it, Rim. Damn it, tire. Damn it. Ugh. Well, you keep going at it anyways. Like, damn it. Damn it. But you keep going anyways. Damn it. Four. You see that? That's a tire coming off of a rim. And you're like, oh damn, I'm almost there, but you're really not. You're like, oh. Ah. 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 And then you're like, oh damn. I did it! Ah. And you go to pull the tire out and you're like, oh shit! Why is the rim still on the damn tire? I didn't understand that the first time, so I just threw that crap on the floor, pull up the rim a little bit, get a nice little spot, and you go, oh damn it! Pry it out a bit, so you can get your crowbar in. You get your crowbar in, and you're like, oh damn it! So you get your Ajax and you put it right there on those two little spots right there. You're like, oh damn, it's gonna come out now. You spit on it a few times, get the stuff soaping up, 
and now is when you get angry. But I forgot to grab my anger. My handful, and she steps when I apply some sweat, spit, and tears. And you get, a, you get real angry now. Oh, come out of there! Get out of the bathroom, I gotta poop! I'll take some time to rest. Drink some soap. For those of you who enjoy things up your ass, you can do this. Running and screaming is optional, but remember safety first. Look both ways when running across the street. And here are my beautiful rims. 